This is the everyday desk I use in the studio along with the live streams for Hot Make. Actually, it's a very thin metal desk and it's not great from what I'm doing and everything rocks. Today, we're gonna fix that. My name's Jim and this is The Edge of Tech. So like I said, this is the desk I use for all my day-to-day -day stuff, whether it's slicing models or putting videos together or even the live streams every Monday night on Hot Mix. When I got the studio, I found some really cheap metal desks and that was working okay, but it's just not great for what I'm doing. My monitor stand here really rocks back and forth, the camera as well. So when I'm doing live streams and I'm very animated, which I am, uh, I hit this thing and everything kind of shakes and it's just not great. Um, along with that, it's just stuff is falling off below. It didn't stay Velcroed up. I had dual lock Velcro strips up and it just didn't stay up. And uh, you know, I just kind of wanted to do something different. Well, my friends over at Ewin emailed me and asked if I wanted to check out a desk. And of course, I'm all about upgrading. So I paid the price of shipping. They sent me a brand new desk and I'm really pumped to put it in the place of this one and see how it goes. There's a lot of cool features on this new desk and I'm actually really excited to share them with you. But what I'm gonna do is kind of take this all apart. I'm gonna drop the new desk in, put everything back on it, and then we'll talk about the new desk and how it looks. For you, that'll be right now. So what I'm gonna do there uh, is when I get everything else put on, I'll do this and we'll maybe do like a transition snap thing and it'll be all new. And poof, just like that, the desk is now here. It is almost completely wired and uh, it looks great. I, I gotta say, I absolutely love the look of this desk. It looks really nice. It is much, much better built than that metal uh, desk that I was using. It's much thicker. The monitors are on here and, and the, unless I move the whole desk, they don't even rock, which is great. I'm not completely done with this because I use some bad Velcro for putting stuff up underneath the desk and it started falling. So I'm gonna redo all that, but that's nothing to do with the desk or the quality or anything itself. It's all to do with the garbage Velcro I used and the bad adhesive. So let's check out the desk a little closer. The Ewan desk came really nicely packaged. Shipping was fast, nothing was damaged inside, and it actually came unharmed, which is kind of unheard of. <laughs> if I pop open the top, you can see it is surrounded in black foam, which is great. Everything has got its place. On the top was this giant card, and actually it is the whole instruction manual right here, as you can see in the picture. Uh, it is pretty cool that they did it like this. It's really big, it's super easy to read, and not a bad idea, I just tossed that right in the packaging. It just took me a few minutes to get everything unpackaged, and this desk actually builds in 10 minutes or less. It is so fast. It is literally like 11 bolts and that's all you need. As you can see from this picture, uh, the desk is super solid. The legs on this desk, they're nice metal and they bolt in super secure and it, it doesn't wobble, it doesn't move. It's a very, very solid desk. I actually had the desk inside of the packaging still and I bolted everything on there so I wouldn't damage the top and assembly was just crazy easy. Once I got it assembled, I plugged in the included USB and audio jack adapter straight into my computer. And as you can see from this picture, the lights came on. They're bright, they're pretty cool. There's lights down the side of the leg and along the side of the desk here. And they're on, then they're bright. Like I said, more on that in a minute. So included also was a headphone holder. You can see it right here. I actually don't use headphones in the studio usually, so I just kind of folded that in. Uh, on the other side, on the other side behind me is actually a drink holder. I love that, I've been using it. The last two hot makes when we use this, I, I actually was able to throw my drinks right in there. It holds a, a large, large beverage or something small, just like a can. A quick side note, this does not need to be loose like this. There is a bolt that you can tighten uh, up underneath here and it should be tightened. I had just loosened it up when I was kind of swiveling it around. Like I said, I usually keep it kind of folded back because I'm not gonna use it. So as you can kind of see from the top here, it does have a carbon fiber finish. Uh, it is really nice. I really like the feel of this desk. I, I like that I can wipe it off if it does get a little dirty. I like that it's smooth. I like that I don't have to have a giant mouse pad. Um, you can if you want to, but with this top, you wouldn't need to. Just build quality overall, I would have to get this a 10 out of 10. This, the build quality on this desk 
is very, very nice. Full disclosure, I paid $60 for the shipping of the desk and that's all they charged me. I didn't pay for anything else. And so they sent me the desk, I paid for the shipping, which was $60. They were gonna reimburse me if I sold three or more of desks through a link that I'm gonna put in the description below. So if I do sell three or more, they're gonna reimburse that $60. If not, I get to keep the desk uh, free charge for doing this video. So we talked a minute ago about the lights. Now, I was super excited to get RGB lights on a desk. Everything else, I can recommend about this desk. The fit, the finish, the sturdiness. In the back here, there's a grommet hole. On the other side, something I forgot to talk about, there's actually a wireless charging pad and it spins and it reveals a USB port that you can charge things as well. There is something about this desk, <laughs> I just ran into it, uh, that I might consider a showstopper for some of you. Um, it is the lights. The lights are cool. They're RGB, they're fun, they're bright, but they're supposed to work when they're sound and when they're sound only. Um, in my case, there's no sound and they're on right now and they don't turn off ever. I don't, I don't want that. Uh, I would be okay with the sound thing if it was just activated with sound, I would be even better if it had like a remote control and you could change the patterns and the colors and all that cool stuff. Um, you can't do that, so there's that. Now, I did write the company. Um, I reached out to the person who reached out to me and I said, hey, this is going on. I even sent them a video of me plugging it in and showing the lights going. And the response I got was that this is normal, that these are how the new controllers work it's a different controller than they used before. There's a little disclaimer on the page that shows that it could be different, which is fine. The problem I have is that they never turn off unless I unplug them. So I got to reach under and unplug the cables every time I want to turn them off. I just think they could do better. Um, this isn't a cheap desk. And I think that for the price, they could do better. They could find a better controller. They could make these lights even cooler. They could, you know, make them on demand or remote control or whatever you want. Um, and I think that would be like the icing on the cake because Ewan, you have a really nice desk here. I like that they're on. I like that they're bright. I like they're nice. They're, they're gonna be really cool. And I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take, there's a, a control box underneath. I'm gonna take the cover off and see what kind of plugs it uses. And I'm gonna find a different control box. I'm gonna put that in. I think this will be much, much better of a desk. Uh, maybe I'll do a follow-up video, I'm not sure. I think that if you're looking for a desk, if this is in your price range, check the description below. There's a coupon code for you. If it's in your price range, if you're looking for a nice sturdy desk that looks really nice, it really does look really nice. It's sturdy. It is built very nicely as far as, uh, I think it's gonna hold up for a long time. And you just need something that looks great for your games or your office or whatever. Uh, I think this could be the desk for you, so definitely check it out. If you're looking at buying this for the RGB lights, huh, you, you heard my warning. I, I just can't, I can't recommend it just for the lights itself. So uh, maybe if I find a better controller and I put that out there for you guys, that's a different story. Uh, I think this is great. I think it works really nice. Everything looks good on this desk. I can swing in my microphone when I do hot makes. So I have my microphone right there. It's on the side of the desk. It's very sturdy. Uh, my camera obviously up there, my monitors, my some, some speakers, and everything fits really nice on the desk. So I guess what I'm saying is if you're looking for a desk, consider it, check it out. Uh, I hope you found this a little bit educational on the desk. It is such an upgrade, a huge upgrade from my other desk. And I really appreciate uh, you in for sending this over. Thank you again. If you're not looking for a desk, maybe you're looking for a new printer that would look absolutely gorgeous, much like this desk, then check out this link right there.